Good morning, everyone. It is Wednesday. Everyone, I'm out on my walk this morning. Oh, the air is thick today. It is going to be a muggy day. It's supposed to be up near 90 today, so. <sighs> So I'm out taking my walk. Um, nice breeze this morning. Birds are chirping away as you can hear. Definitely not wake yet. So hopefully I wake up quick. But I'm gonna do my walk down to the boat ramp again back. Get with you along the way. Very quiet out here this morning. Not many cars going by. It's typical and you know normally goes by at this time of the day. The ear is thick though. Whew. Sucking wind already. But almost the boat ramp. Two thirds of the way there. It is a gorgeous morning out though. Like I said, I love about this time there's nobody out. Nice and quiet. You don't have to talk. Just a nice walk. So I'll get with you once I get to the boat ramp. Alright, down at the boat ramp now. The bugs are driving me nuts. I forgot to put the bug spray on again. Oh, that is so annoying. Right by the ears. They're constantly flying by the ears. And it's pretty as a morning as it's been. Kind of cloudy and foggy. I think I just got the horse fly. Um, that is pretty of a morning. Kind of cloudy and foggy. Water's so nice and clear. You can see the bugs hitting the top of the water there. They make like a popping sound when they hit the top. I think I made pretty good time down here. I'm gonna check here. I think 20 minutes down here. Not bad. Alright, so I'm gonna head back. I'm gonna see if I can make it back in 15 minutes. So if I make it back by 5.35, I did really good time. So my case is building up a lot. I've been doing this now for three weeks and depending on what time of the day I weigh myself I've lost between 12 and 15 pounds so I figure I had another 20 to go so by Labor Day I think I could do it I just gotta stick with it I need to stop watching what I eat now too because I'm still eating a little bit of junk stuff that I really shouldn't eat but we'll see but all right, I need to get going or I'm gonna stay down here all day because I love this area right here. And I don't think my work would be too appreciative if I didn't go in today. So I'm heading back to the house, get with you along the way. All right, everyone back at the house now. Made it back for 5.40, I did not what I wanted to do. So 15 minutes for a mile, not bad for walking. A uh, nice four mile an hour pace. So if I can keep that up, maybe I'll eventually start going to jogging. Uh, depends on, I don't know whether my hips and my knees will, you know, hold up for it. Uh, a lot of injuries in my younger years, so we'll have to see. But uh, now it's a good walk. Back at 20 of, have a cup of coffee, let the dogs out, and actually eat breakfast. Uh, without having a rush to get into work, so it's nice. Uh, so, all right. I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna have that coffee. I'm gonna let those dogs out. I'm gonna have my breakfast, take a shower, and the next time that you see me, I'm gonna be in the truck. Hey everyone, I'm down in the truck right now, getting ready to go into work. Uh, it's gonna be a muggy hot day here today in New England. Uh, they're saying 90-ish today with heat index around 100. So, that's a muggy day. Uh, Nothing going on. I have absolutely nothing to do this afternoon. Depending on the temperature, I may try to get the drone up in the air. I still need to do that challenge video. Uh, just, I have some, like I said uh, late last night, I have some family stuff going on, and it's really difficult for me to uh, record right now. So if, if the videos are lacking, I apologize, but family comes first. Uh, like I said, I'm heading into work right now. Should be a normal day, hopefully. I don't have to 
rush anywhere to do anything today. So hopefully it's a good day. Uh, yeah, so I'm out of here. I'll get with you guys throughout the day like I do every day. Dash cam. nice in my office here because I control my own air conditioning so it's nice and comfortable but I guarantee you when I get out to that truck this camera is going to fog right up but uh, no thunderstorms uh, supposed to be like this for the next couple of days summertime in New England what are you going to do but like I said I'm heading out of here next time you see me I'll be in the truck all right I'm out in the truck right now and it is incredibly humid out here so I'm going to be really quick because this camera lens is going to fog right up uh, heading home right now. Not exactly sure what we're gonna do tonight. Try to do something, go for a walk at least. Um, I know Ashley has volleyball tonight, so one of us, either Leah or myself, is gonna have to take her over and pick her up, so we'll deal with that. But anyway, I'm heading out of here. Camera's starting to fog up. I'll get with you once I get home, like I do every single day. Dash cam. eventful night so far uh we're going on a walk right now but got home there was as this truck goes by yeah that's a redneck truck that's what i was just saying that was a redneck truck wow <laughs> uh, now nah, i'm not even gonna touch that well, anyway, uh, got home about four o'clock, went to go use the phone to check our voicemail, and we didn't have a dial tone. So, we're trying to get in contact with Verizon, they call you back. So, I went on to Twitter, they got in touch with me there. Basically, they had us unplug all the phones and then plug them back in, and by that time, the phone came back on. Now, is that a case of unplugging the phones resets everything, or is it a case of it just gave them some time to fix whatever the problem was? So we used to have that problem with an ISP. They would tell at my work they would tell us to shut everything down and then reboot, you know, the computers, and that would give them the time to fix whatever the problem was. Because one time I didn't reboot, waited 10 minutes, and then all of a sudden the computers were back up. So we'll see. But we're going on the walk. Actually, I gotta run back in because I got a battery light, so I gotta change the battery, and then we're gonna go on a walk. We are heading back to the house. We already made it to the boat ramp. We got Bjorn Borg over here. Venus William was a her tennis racket. She's upset because it's not making a zapping noise when it hits the bugs. It's I don't know whether it's really working or not. Yeah. Well, it was a cheap one we got at Job Lot. So we'll have to go out and get you a good one. The light comes on, so yeah. technically it's supposed to be working. So the light comes on and no one's home? Probably. <laughs> I don't know. I haven't got a big enough bug. <laughs> you hear it over there? Oh. You can't see him, but you can hear him. Yeah, we got frogs. I don't know whether the mic will pick that up. beautiful sun reflecting off the lake down there. I wish I had a clear shot. You alright? Yeah, I told you I can't see. I'm <laughs> blinding myself. I'm falling off the parking. You're blind in one eye, can't see out the other? 
It is a, as you can see, a gorgeous sunset right now. And I don't have a clear view, but you can actually see the bugs on the lake. It looks like all little drops. We got up ahead, you might be able to see better picture where they cut all those trees. But oh, this is nice. It could be like this all year round and I'd be happy. A little lower humidity, but a little less bugs too. I've been doing the walks now since July 1st. We've been since about the 8th she started with me. And they are, I, I do feel a difference doing them. It's a lot better getting out of the house and then just sitting there on the computer or on the phone get some exercise and get to meet the neighbors and all that stuff so everyone's so friendly so, oh my god it's flying <laughs> <laughs> i thought it was good but it's flying like no, i said gorgeous over. sunset tonight the lighting right now for the camera too is like perfect just and just look at it oh, yeah. the lighting now just stay down there another half hour and you would have got oh it'd be gorgeous gorgeous colors they don't worry about the morning <laughs> Lee, <laughs> could you do me a favor? What? Does it hurt to actually touch that tennis racket? Yeah. <laughs> my arm's still tingling. It's like from here to here. It's all like tingly. <laughs> wow. So I guess it does work. <laughs> I got nothing more to say on that. Enough said. I just wish I had the camera going because <laughs> five foot two, two Lee here jumped so high she could have dunked a basketball. <laughs> you might try it. <laughs> wow. Show us how it's done. It's pretty all right. Oh, what? that was that was too funny. <laughs> well, that... it does apparently retain the electrical current after the button's been released. <laughs> they didn't lie. <laughs> at the beach right now getting some beautiful beautiful sunset shots and oh this is gorgeous this is why I love living up here this is absolutely gorgeous right now oh, we got our pictures there's a mama duck with two baby ducks going into the water beautiful they came up and said hello Yes, they came up to the fence and said hello. <laughs> they didn't go off the grass. But... It's good and bad because you really don't want a lot of ducks on the water. You know, nice to see, but the duck poop ends up polluting the water. It promotes algae growth and plant growth, the nitrogens in, in the duck poop. Uh, it's even worse if you get the Canadian geese here because they try to shoo away the Canadian geese. They used to put right across the edge of the water. They used to put a snow fence up there just to keep the geese away. I'm surprised they're not doing it now. They used to do it every night. The geese aren't here. Uh, the uh, that is an absolutely beautiful sunset. There's a little bit of daylight here, so we're gonna head back. This is the main entrance to the beach at Spring Lake. And these are all the old beach houses. They're now full-time houses. This used to be a beach community, like weekend houses and cottages and stuff. All right, we're coming back from our walk. Lee and I just noticed this transformer. This does not look like it has too much time left in it for this world. And it is in rough shape. Yeah. All right, yeah, that transformer just does not look like it's gonna last much longer, so. Yeah, we're gonna have a loud pop and a buzz, but luckily it's a different circuit than where our house is, so. He's not gonna get me. I already got my hand. You gotta make, you make sure you don't hit your hand again there, hon? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at all my digits. They're working. <laughs> Just jump start in my heart, no problem. If I have a, ever have a heart attack, 
I'm gonna touch I it. I don't want Lee to use the IUD. <laughs> <laughs> Even though she's been trained, and I know she would probably do really good. That was 80. 80, excuse me. What's, oh, IUD is <laughs> no, not No, you're out. not getting an intrauterine device. Ooh, Don't worry. I won't do that I think you. I should edit that part out. <laughs> I meant AED. Yeah. Um, you have a little birdie hopping along. The ear is very thick right now. The temperature's going down. It's getting thicker, so we're almost home. It's going to be up for the walk tonight. Uh, I guarantee it was two miles, but we stopped a lot, so it was nice, though. Nice walk tonight. Yes? Yes. But it's getting kind of hazy and hard to see. Yeah. I think that's just your glasses. Could be. <laughs> I think it's the shock from the tennis racket. It threw <laughs> your, your, your vision off. Could be. Watch, take your glasses off. You can probably see 2020 now. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> nope, no such luck. But, I'll zap a few more times. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know I'm good. I gotta call my brother when I get in. <laughs> <laughs> Those people have a story to tell. <sighs> I just went, oh God, why didn't I have the camera running? <laughs> oh, that was how she looked. She looked like Spud Webb winning the slam dunk competition back in the 80s. Oh, that was funny. Oh, well, I said I see a different park. And, uh, apparently it keeps a charge for a while <laughs> <laughs> thanks for watching my video if you like what you saw please click the thumbs up over here if you want you can subscribe below here and click the bell icon that'll give you notifications if you want you can click up here to subscribe if you want to see my last video you can click right here if you want to see a video from about a year ago click right here thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys again tomorrow